Okay, we're out here today to test out a new half ounce spinner bait. You can see the uh, the bat or spinner bait here. It has 062 wire, all brass components, number six and number five Indiana blade, a keel head design that makes it rise to the surface a lot easier than a conventional. I have the Gamagatsu wide gap hook molded into it and you can see the keeper right there and I'm going to show you how to rig it there's a couple different about three different ways but my preference is I call it the rubber banding and all you do is stick it past the barb pop it through slide it down to the keeper pop it over the keeper and then just hit put the hook in between the two little eyes This is a Z-Man flapping crawl. Very durable. You can reuse this bait over and over and over again until you lose a pincher. Then if you lose a pincher, you can still use it for a standard spinner bait. But you can Texas rig it or rubber band it like I call it. And you can see the small piece of rubber, rubber right there. That's why I call it rubber banding. And there's a log jam and a beaver hooch off here to the left. And you can see a little bit of ice over here to the right. There's a little log laying down here in front of me. I don't know if the camera will pick it up, but we'll flip it out here and see if it uh, oh, slides over that log pretty good. And there's a uh, limb out here. Just throw it in there and let it come over it. Let it slide right through. No problem for it. Drop it down there like a bass jig. Let it slide over. And I was down in uh, Lake Barkley, pre-fishing for a bass tournament. Had the prototypes down there, and that's what I was doing. My partner had a standard spinner bait, and all he could do was just swim it over top. And I was yo-yoing it down in between the logs, and got a five and a half pound largemouth out of there. But that was with. Uh, 041 wire and it kind of bent it up a little bit. That's why I went the 062 because I'm throwing it into heavy debris fields and lily pads and stems and all that kind of stuff. And I can even throw it on the bank and it'll come off. Just like the buzz bait I showed. But just wanted to show you the versatility of this lure and where it can go. And also it's guaranteed for six months and if it does not perform the way I say it performs, you get your money back 100%. All right, thanks. We'll keep you updated.